up? It's the Pierre Shelby, and today we're going to talk about this beautiful Camaro RSS. We're going to speak to the owner, and obviously, I'm going to ask him my lovely questions so you guys get to know more about this car. We're going to talk about all the custom features of this car and how awesome it is. Let's check it out. What? This is sick. This is why this car is so loud, huh? Yeah. Okay, cool. So I'm here with the owner, my friend D. He's gonna tell us more interesting facts and cool things that he did to this car and how he customized it. So what's going on, D? Hey, what's going on? So tell me about this motor, man, because this is like really huge. What's going on here? Well, it's a 427, uh -huh. 30 over, big block, iron head block. So you got the tarantula. They call this a tarantula because usually carburetor sits straight and this one sits on an angle. Okay. Got aluminum radiator, double fans, you know, just the regular stuff. Regular stuff. Yeah. This car is really loud, guys. Don't let him fool you. It's super loud and super fast. And you're going to hear it later on in the video. Let's talk about your rent. Let's talk about how cool your rims are because I see that you have like different colors going on. I like the red too around it. So what's going on with the rims? Well, the rims, they're 24 by 14 Forgiatos. They were mm -hmm. custom made. The outer barrel was changed and they come with the floating cap. Oh, what? <laughs> That's so cool. Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, and so also like your rear end is much bigger obviously than the front. So what's going on here? What do they do uh, with this? The rear end had to be shortened. This is actually a Dana rear end. Mm -hmm. So the rear end had to be shortened. I had to put mini tubs in the inside. Okay. Usually with mini tubs, you have to cut the back seat and they don't let you keep it. So with my car, I was able to keep a back seat with the rear end and the mini tubs. Oh, that's really, really cool, really cool. Let's check out the inside. What's going on inside here? Cause it's really cool in here. Like I want them to see everything. Um, obviously we have, what are these? This is a tag. That's for your water and oil and your RPM gauge for this, so you can know when to shift. Because oh, the manual shift, you don't just let it go through drive and one, two, three. You gotta pull it. Okay, got you, got you. Oh, what? This looks like a super, and you also stated that this is like the first ever body yeah, this Camaro. Is the first generation Camaro 67. They only made them in the 67, 68, and 69. This body style. <laughs> this is so cool. I gotta buy one of these, man. This is really cool, really cool. And I like the feel too. And I also like that how you got these seatbelts. Cause remember I asked you about the seatbelts and you were like, yeah. Yeah, that's a uh, <laughs> precaution for racing. You need, if you're gonna race, you don't need these seatbelts because the car doesn't come with airbags. Right, got you, got you. Good to know. I just like the seatbelts because they look really cool. Well, let's take it for a drive. Is that cool? That's fine. Yes, let's go. Our crazy ride first off this car takes off speed like super fast so don't underestimate this car and I also have some questions for you D why this car why the Camaro why the first ever this body well I wasn't born in 67 but I <laughs> always watching Fast and Furious and mm -hmm. they always had Camaros and I always had a liking for them so mm -hmm. when I finally got a chance to get one of those the car that I wanted. okay that's really cool and then also why the rims why these type of rims too um, well the culture now is the resto mod you take the older cars and you put like a newer look on it mm -hmm. so the newer look is the Portiato and everybody right. else you know the three-piece rim and you know the nice style yeah, especially with the spinning cap. That's like super cool to me. <laughs> well, and then obviously my last question is, do you have like any other cars that you have that we don't know about? Or do are you thinking about like any other cars to buy and custom make in the near future that we can look out for? I want to build a vertical. I don't know what kind of vertical yet, but I want to do something 
Really? So we have to link up and do your other two cars then? Yes, for sure, for sure. Well, I'm so excited. I really like this car as well because the first ever Camaro, this is something you rarely see, especially on the road. So thank you so much for your time, D, man. It was super cool. And until next time, this is my guy, D. You can follow him on Instagram. I'll leave his Instagram tag. Okay, good. I'll leave his Instagram tag below for you guys to you can follow him. And until next time, I'm Superior Shelby. Check it out. Peace. If you've enjoyed this video, make sure you like, subscribe, and turn on push notifications and visit aswips.net. Peace!